So this is the long love letter I have received from Colorado Transport Department from a cop. This is the ticket of $113 and the reason says weaving. So that is a new term to learn for me. Weaving? Wow. All right, need to go and make the payment. Morning. Today is the last day of the drive. I'm going to drive to the airport, drop the car and fly to Los Angeles. So here is a big news. I just got a ticket from Colorado Transport Department for $113. I'm going to explain to you how. It was fun and a good experience as well. So yeah, this is how it went. That day I was driving from Glenwood Springs to Estes Park. It was a long drive, 280 kilometers. And that moment I had already been done with 200 kilometers. Uh, I found a police cop, straight trooper was the car. It was named like straight trooper. It was kind of the policeman, yeah. And I found him tailing me for like five or 10 minutes. Then after five or 10 minutes of tailing, I found he started flashing the lights. So I knew something was wrong. I slowed down and he asked me to get to the side of the road, went by and he said, you're going to get a ticket. I said, I was like, yeah, for what? He said, I found you have been weaving through the lens, but I was pretty sure I am not doing that because I mean, yeah, weaving was a new term for me. He started to explain it to me with a paper and pen <laughs> and so as per him, I was changing the lens too fast and my indicator engagement was not timely. I mean, as per him, I was engaging my indicators a bit delayed, but I'm pretty sure I was not doing that because I've already done more than 4,700 kilometers in the US. If you look at my stats in India, in last nine years, I've been driving cars since nine years now. And India have total done somewhere around 7,000 kilometers all total in nine years. And outside in India, I have done close to uh, 7,500 approx. So you can pretty much make out. I've already done a lot of drive outside India and I know the rules and regulations. I drive really well. And yeah, I also engage my indicators timely as well. But that day it was, I mean, roads were completely empty. So maybe that is the reason I was engaging the indicators a bit delayed, but yeah, I was doing it at least four to five seconds before I am taking or changing the lens. But as per the cop, it was not being done right. I did not argue because he was just so professional and he started to explain it to me. And he started to explain it to me with a pen and paper, with the writings, law book, everything. I was just so stupid done to see such a professional cop. Wow, it was such a good experience. I just went ahead and said, yeah, please get me the ticket. What is the details you need? He asked me for my driving license. He asked me for my car rental agreement. Got all those details, went to his car. Trust me, he took exactly 35 minutes inside his car to write all those details in a huge paper, which I just showed it to you. Came to the car back, handed it to, over to me and said, you have a ticket of $113.80. You need to make the payment at Denver Transport Department office. I was like, I'm not from US, I'm from India, just a tourist and I'm driving. So he said, I have no idea. You need to do your own stuff, make the payment or you would not be allowed to drive in the US again. <laughs> and yeah, I know, I'd got a ticket, I had to just make the payment, I was just getting the details about how to make the payment. Sadly, they don't have any option to make the ticket payment online, so I have to do that money order thing. I basically asked my car rental company to get the process done for me, I'm going to pay them the money, give them the ticket copy, keep one ticket copy with me, and that should be it. So this is how it went and in India, trust me, I don't even drive. The reason is the more I drive, the more high my blood pressure gets and I'm most prone to maybe easy heart attack because whenever I'm driving in India, 90% of my time goes in abusing. 
people are such assholes just drive so bad and yeah, I mean I'm just tired of abusing the people in India driving they have absolutely no sense of driving and God knows when they're going to learn I just hope Indian government whew, I'm tired working so yeah I just hope Indian government gets some kind of such penalty huge penalties needs to be done to our people at least until unless our people get to make such huge penalty payments done they're not going to learn they're such idiots anyways so that was my ticket experience it was good I mean yeah at least I came to know a new ticket reason that was weaving on my paper it says weaving and and weaving means you're changing the lens too fast and not engaging the indicators on time but I was pretty sure I was doing that but I was just so stunned to see the professional cop and his <laughs> behavior it was just so good I actually filmed the whole process as well but he came to know I was filming he said I cannot be in your video so kindly just delete he was so polite to tell that as well went ahead deleted that but yeah I had to make this video I'm just going to go off to Denver right now make the ticket payment and we'll be going off to Los Angeles and then off to India Whew. Indian drivers please get your asses right on road high time we need to ride drive well in Indian roads bye bye